Warzone 2 doesn't come out for another month, but I've already set a world record. Back in September, I got invited to play the new Call of Duty with a few of my closest friends. We then proceeded to get edged for like three hours, playing all the other game modes until it was finally time for the main attraction. Honestly, I was shocked. What? I didn't set out to break a record. Like a resident of Utah, I just tried to soak it all in. Sleek new black jet. Played at new places, pushed full teams by myself. Ow, I'm dead. Then pretend to be shocked and upset when it didn't work out and I died. The only thing I thought was remotely record breaking was the combination of committing both murder and Grand Theft Auto by stealing a helicopter. But still, standard stuff. Then I got a surprise. We just dropped at airport. By this time, I'm used to the new looting system. Found myself an MP5 and a kill when one of the developers came over to give me the news. Okay. Turns out I'd done it in the very first game. Someone had floated over my way in the pregame lobby. I used the aimbot every streamer has to not get a headshot and tried to make friends. Wait, you, you want to be my friend? Then I did it. According to reliable and uncredible sources, this was the record-breaking attempt for quickest execution in Warzone 2. 